this is nice and cruising, huh? 20 miles an hour. Ain't no thing but a chicken wing. You know, I can really easy give you the quick review on this bike. If you just want a bike for cruising around town, no real trails, nothing really extreme, nothing super fancy, but looks good and is incredibly comfortable to ride, check out this bike. You will not be sad about it. Now, if you know the difference between mechanical disc brakes and hydraulic disc brakes, then I would not buy his bike. And here's why. That probably means you know a little bit something about bikes. And well, this bike, nothing wrong with it, but it's also not meant to replace your Tour de France bike that you you know are riding on the trails of uh, France. This is meant literally to go through the neighborhood, go check the mail. I like that it does include the rear rack. One more thing that I mentioned here is, uh, does have a range that says 55. When I got on this, it said it had four bars and now it only has two. Um, not a big deal. Also not, I actually like these LCD displays more than the, the more complicated ones because I can see them with my um, polarized sunglasses. That is awesome. And these just work. There's nothing fancy about them. They don't connect to your app. In fact, my Apple Watch just asked me, do I want to record? Um, this is a cycle workout. That's what I use to track everything. Once you get up and going, man, this is cruising along 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. Nice and easy, lemon squeezy. I dig it. Now I've been so spoiled by hydraulic disc brakes that uh, it's really tough for me to go back to mechanical ones, but it's not that big of a deal in the grand scheme of things. And this bike is just not meant for the person that really needs that much braking power because they're not gonna get up and going real fast. You're just, I mean, literally just meant to cruise through the neighborhood like this and look good. And it's just a cruiser. If you want a cruiser at a good price, good value and want it from a you know you don't need the highest end bike in the world check this bike out it's a great price 